ingredient in marketing your home. And we've solicited the fabulous advice and help from Roxy. Roxy's like Cher. She only goes by one name. We know her as Roxy. What Roxy does for us is stage our homes. When we have a problem house, you know what we do? We bring them to Roxy. You know what Roxy does? She makes the house beautiful. Roxy, tell us the first thing you think about when you see a blank palette like this one started up. When I see a blank palette, I think we're selling a lifestyle, especially at the beach here at Terry. It's important. When people walk in, literally 30 seconds, they make up their mind whether or not they want to view that property. Plus, I would say 80% of the people who are looking today look online before they contact the realtor. So it's very important to see stand out amongst your competition, to look better. You just, you get one chance to make a good impression. Wow, so that's the analogy. Chance, yeah. You got one shot at it. This is like a dating scene. <laughs> you see that house across the aisle and you know whether that house is yours or not yours in the first 30 seconds. And that's why we're smart enough to hire Roxy. Now, that sounds easy to do, but there's some, there's some important ingredients that go into that. We're in a price war and a beauty contest, so it's Roxy's job to make it look beautiful, and then we have to help with the lifestyle. Here at Sunset Island, selling the lifestyle is a piece of cake, but the house still has to get them excited. We want to make it theirs. Is that what you try? Yes, they want to come in and see I'm buying the beach, okay? But they also want to see where will my children play? Where will we gather for dinner? Where will we watch the game? Where will mom and dad stay when they come? So that's what I try to do. You take the property and you create a visual picture for them where they can come in and visualize living in beautiful Sunset Island, but yet they can add their own touches. Also, I want to mention that uh, oftentimes staging, it's not like furnishing a home. It's not at all like that because what we're doing is we're taking the attributes of the property and we are optimizing those. So that means that we're going to show a more open space plan. Uh, for the people, prospective right. buyer, we're going to neutralize, if you would, uh, to appeal to more buyers who are looking. Right, and so you can't be too on, crazy. No, you can't be um, with a little fish and, and that sort yeah. of thing. But then again, you have to allow the prospective buyer to be able to add those little things as he desires. The, the, the one thing um, that that I excel at, at staging starts in Excel, that I would say, is walking that thin line between creating uh, an effective for a prospective buyer on a tight budget. The last thing anyone, any homeowner wants to do is shell out a bunch of money to make their property show like a million. So it's a very thin line we walk. You know, and that's a really and that's a really good point. The other really good point here on the shore when we're working with Roxy, this isn't borrowed furniture. This is bought. This is bought and stays with the property because we sell these suckers fully furnished, ready to go. So what Roxy is able to do is use her keen eye, pick really, really contemporary colors. And the one thing that I must tell you, Roxy, that you do better than any other stager, your stuff doesn't look the same each and every time. You change it up. I mean, you're right there, changing the color of the tie and the suit all the time. So I want to compliment you on that. Thank you. Where do you get that eye from? Well, 25 years of design experience, furnishing model homes, and as well as res residential clients. Um, I just love it. I love what I do. I absolutely love staging homes because it's a win-win, Terry. Uh, the, the property owner wins by selling. The realtor wins. Everybody wins, and I just love helping people. It's such a gratifying business. You know what, you know what Roxy and I talked about before? And, uh, and Chris and I aren't smart enough to stage them ourselves. We're smart enough to hire Roxy. <laughs> but what, what we always talk about is, you know, that first car that you had and you bought, when you bought it, it was beautiful, it was shiny. Then you rode around in it, it got dirty and horrible. You needed the money. You had to clean that car up and sell it. That's basically why we hire Roxy. She shines the heck out of these properties for us, makes them look beautiful, and the furniture conveys. I can't say it enough. We have five for five in the last 10 months with staging properties with Roxy. And we've said this before, you gotta spend money to make money. So if you wanna get top dollar for your property, here's my girl right here, Roxy. You gotta look her up, she's the best. One last thing, on three Roxy, lock it up. One, two, three, lock it up. Lock it up.